Unbelievably insulting, Bumble apologizes for Billboard ad campaign. Bumble has apologized after it appeared to make fun of celibate women in a new advertising campaign. The dating app ran a Billboard campaign with slogans including, you know full well a vow of celibacy is not the answer, and, thou shall not give up dating and become a nun. Social media users called the campaign unbelievably insulting, patronizing, and a tone deaf. The company has now apologized and admitted, we made a mistake. It added, our ads referencing celibacy were an attempt to lean into a community frustrated by modern dating and instead of bringing joy and humor, we unintentionally did the opposite. Many people criticized the adverts, which appeared in the US, for misunderstanding why women choose celibacy. Some said celibacy is a response to trauma, while for others, it is a choice not to settle. Asexual people may choose to be celibate and still date and for some, it is a religious choice. Increasingly, celibacy is also used as a protest against patriarchal societies, with South Korea's Furby movement attracting global attention as women began to cut men out of their lives. Furby is shorthand for four Korean words that all start with by him meaning no, according to journalist Anna Louise Sussman, who covered the movement last year for The Cut magazine. As well as the public apology, Bumble said it will be donating to the National Domestic Violence Hotline and other organizations that support women. Billboard spaces will also be offered to the organizations to display and add of their choice for the remaining time period that Bumble reserved them for. In a statement, the company said it has passionately stood up for women and marginalized communities and their right to fully exercise personal choice for years. The dating app company is going through a rough patch. Its shares have fallen steadily since last July, dropping roughly 45% over that time amid concerns over its ability to reach younger users. In February, it laid off 350 employees, roughly 30% of its workforce, when it announced plans to revamp its app in order to make it more attractive to Generation Z. The latest ad campaign was designed to launch the revamped app.